House Bill 153 will right-size state government. By reducing the House and the Senate by 25 percent, uh, we'll obviously won't be relying on as much taxpayers' money to do our overall operations. Um, and it sends a message that we don't have the money uh, to completely fund what we need to, so we need to start with the state government the General Assembly first and foremost to try to right-size us uh, in order to send a message that we're serious about right-sizing government for the entire government system. It's an important step to let the taxpayers know we're serious about right-sizing government. We're going to create more efficiencies. Uh, less members means we will be able to move legislation and come to compromise much easier uh, to have a more aggressive uh, agenda on behalf of the residents of Pennsylvania, move Pennsylvania forward, uh, bring economic prosperity, and ensure um, their money is served well uh, when it comes up to Harrisburg. With a constitutional amendment, it needs to pass two consecutive sessions. So after we pass it out of the House of Representatives today, it'll go to the Senate. The Senate will need to pass it. And then next session, we'll have to restart the process of passing it out of either the House or Senate. The other chamber will take it up. After it's passed by both chambers in two successive sessions, it'll go to the voters to vote. And they'll have a final say to say whether they want a smaller General Assembly, cut by 25 percent. Hunt 203 House members down to 153, 50 senators down to 38 senators.